What's going on everyone? It's Ian K back again with another high quality foodie feature for you here on Peep This Hour Reviews. Cheaters Cam Style, headed into Taco Bell after hours to check out their latest promo which could possibly net you a free Xbox Series X. That's right, it's the Grande Stacker Box, so stay tuned because it's up next. Welcome to Peep This Out Reviews with Ian K. Stay frosty. How are you doing today? Good, how are you doing? You know, keep this out. Can I go for that Grande Stacker Box uh, with uh, the medium diet Pepsi, and that'll be cool. Any hot sauce? Uh, let's do it with some fire, please. Okay, six fifty-six to win that. Great, thank you. All right, so I'm definitely down to win a free Xbox Series X. That's pretty cool. Hey, yeah, how you doing? Awesome, very cool. Thank you, thank you. There you go. So, is this one going to be the winning cup? Is this one going to be the winning cup? <laughs> we'll see what's up. Thanks, brother. Stay frosty. We'll see you. All right, guys. Let's beep this out. So here we go with the Grande Stacker Box here at Taco Bell, along with a promo to help kick off the launch of the Xbox Series X. And this is not a bad set of goodies we've got in front of us here. Starting off on the side, we've got two crunchy tacos, and I think most of you should know what's in those. Pretty much their seasoned beef. We've got some lettuce and some cheese, and then naturally that taco shell. Two of them here. Over to the side, you've got a medium or large drink in order to qualify for that free Xbox Series X, or to give it a shot, I should say. In this case, I've got a medium diet Pepsi. And for the main star of the show, the Grande Stacker itself. Basically an oversized flour tortilla that's folded over twice to pretty much look like a tortilla chip. On the inside, we've got plenty of seasoned beef, a three cheese blend, and nacho cheese sauce. And I gotta say, it definitely looks pretty hefty and absolutely oversized. So let's see how the flavor's gonna be on this one. We'll focus primarily on this one for sure. It's the Grande Stacker box here at Taco Bell. Let's peep out this flavor. All right, so as you probably noticed through the drive-thru, my local Taco Bell doesn't have this promo for $5 as nationally advertised. It is what it is, $5.99 over here in Southern Cali. But I do have to admit what you are getting is pretty sizable, guys. Even still, it actually looks pretty decent there, especially with the tacos. Now, granted, I have it kind of positioned in the box and it's kind of filling it out, but even still, that Grande Stacker does look pretty big. So at least it lives up to its name because of the size of what it is. So naturally, we're gonna get into that. But real quick and like always, if you guys are fans of high quality, delicious looking food reviews, make sure to hit that subscribe button down below. And don't forget to tap that bell icon so you can be notified as soon as brand new content drops every week. Guys, let's do this. I have a feeling I know exactly what I'm in for with this here. Pretty much the same basic ingredients that Taco Bell is known for, but just very basic this time out. But as you can see, nicely grilled. This really feels like an oversized beef quesadilla that they flip over twice to make the uh, shape that you see here. So let's give it a shot. It's the Grande Stacker here at Taco Bell. I'm going to go right in the very tip right over here. Let's do it. Mm, actually, almost had a problem there. That meat is a lot more concentrated at the very tip here. That's crazy. But it's still very dense and there's lots of cheese. Obviously going at the very end over there, it's all gonna be concentrated. But guys, take a look at that on the inside. As you can see, a nice representation of all the seasoned beef, the three cheese blend, the nacho cheese sauce. We're not reinventing the wheel here. It's pretty much the same Taco Bell goodness, but a heavy amount of it. And I gotta say, Grande definitely fits with this item. Let's go for another bite. Mmm, that's thick. Let me get a little closer so you can see the folds of that tortilla in there. As you can see, it is absolutely stacked over here, guys. It really folds over pretty nicely. This is really, like I said, not inventing the wheel over here at Taco Bell, but it's the flavor that you know and love with a heavy amount of that beef and cheese goodness on this one. And again, I'm digging the fact that the name is Stacker. I wish there was just a little bit more in here to make it more stacked. But again, an overabundance of beef is not a bad thing. And the cheese, the flavor that you know, definitely satisfying because of what this is. And as I'm going further into this right now, let me grab a quick sip of the actual drink that comes with this here. In my case, it's gonna be Diet Pepsi. I know a lot of you purists out there are gonna say, why didn't you get Baja Blast? Diet Pepsi is actually really good over here at Taco Bell. It's the only place I like to get it because the flavor is a lot richer compared to others where I've tried it. So definitely digging that. Mmm, really nice. And hopefully the code on this cup will actually net me an Xbox Series X because apparently every 15 minutes you can win one. And that's only if you get a medium drink or a large drink or jump on over to the website that I'll have down in the description. You can pretty much try it for free. But guys, not bad for what this is. Obviously, it really is the Taco Bell that you know and love. There's really not too much else to say about this, but I have to admit, this really does kind of feel like just a value item. Even though the size is decent on it, there's really not too much on the inside except just beef and cheese. And that's cool, but it's lacking just a little bit of something extra. Maybe a little sour cream, considering the price of what this is. Like I said, I love the value of what you're getting here because the size is good but there could be just a little bit more thrown into it for the money. But still, very tasty. 
All right, and because this combo comes with them, we've got a couple of tacos over here, so I figured I'd go for just a quick bite. You know what, let's go for a little bit of that fire sauce action there. We'll put a little bit of that in there and give this a shot. You know, with two of these crunchy tacos being closer to the $3 range, and when you throw in that medium drink there, maybe $4.50 or so, it's still not a bad deal, even at $5.99, considering the amount of food here. Like I said, I only wish there was just a little bit of extra thrown into that grande stacker, but the overall value of what you're getting, even at the elevated price point, is still halfway decent, guys. So let's go for a quick bite on this one. Mmm. Classic Taco Bell. Yeah, that fire sauce works extremely well. And of course, we're getting more of that beefy goodness on the very bottom here, guys. So lots of crunchy lettuce in here, a decent amount of cheese, and of course, that nice corn tortilla on the outside. Decent situation with this. But we came to do more of the other. So let's swing back on over to that grande stacker here. So just to round this one out, guys, as you can see, it's Taco Bell that you know and love. There's really no difference with this compared to the others. A lot of tortilla on this one. And like I said, I wish this had just a little bit more thrown into the mix, but what you're getting here is very, very thick. Kind of reminds me of the crunch wrap a little bit if this was toasted more with some lettuce, but I gotta say guys, still very tasty. All right, maybe more like that folded beef quesadilla, like I said in the very beginning, because there's nothing crunchy on the inside of that, but the heft of it kind of feels like that crunch wrap supreme. It's got that denseness to it, and you'll know it when you pick it up. So with that said, I'm gonna have to give the Grande Stacker Box here at Taco Bell a decent seven out of 10. Like I said all throughout this review, this is not reinventing the wheel at all. And considering the value of being halfway decent with what you're getting in this box, it's not bad. Two of those tacos and the drink alone are pretty much close to the four or $5 range. And you're getting a decent sized value type of item, I gotta say, thrown into the mix there with an oversized tortilla. So decent for what it is, like I said, I wish there was just a little bit of extra on the inside for the money, but even still what you're getting for the money, it's not bad. All right, now I've got two very simple questions for you. First and foremost, are you gonna be giving this one a shot? Drop some comments down below. Let me know what you thought of this one in general and if you're enticed to give this a go, aside from the Xbox promo. And speaking of that Xbox promo, are you gonna be getting an Xbox Series X even if you don't win one? Or are you more of a PS5 type of person? Drop those comments down below and definitely let me know. And with that, this is Ian K closing out another high quality foodie feature for you, Cheaters Cam style. After hours here at Taco Bell, bringing you brand new content every single week here on my channel. So why stay tuned for the next review coming real soon. In the meantime, stay frosty. All right, Taco Bell, if I can drop a quick note into that suggestion box, how about a little chipotle sauce added to this grande stacker? I don't think that's really too much to ask, is it? All right, guys, until next time, I'll talk to you soon. Hey, thanks for checking out another one of my reviews. But just in case you didn't see the one before this one, you can find it right up over here, along with what I think YouTube's gonna recommend for you to check out as well. As always, I think you'll find something to like in both of them, and I'll definitely catch you in the next one. See ya.